All right, you ready to do this thing? Yep. Let's finish this out. The this last it, chapter folks. of the Alan Wake saga. Episode six. Hopefully, we'll figure out what the hell's going on, or barring that, have stuff to bitch about. But in a pleasingly interesting way. I I have some idea. I, I continue to say that I have some idea, but not much. I've played this game myself, and now I've almost watched Andy play the whole thing, and I have no idea what's going on, so... <laughs> I, I have this I have this fear that and expectation really that the end is gonna be this whole thing where it's like open to interpretation. And that pisses me off to know. And it's gonna be like that total recall. Back bullshit. to our baller ass apartment. <laughs> yeah. Apparently the snowstorm finally stopped. Also, Alan Wake rocking the black hoodie. Not under the covers. Nope. Still can't do it. His ass is flat. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> my sunglasses and painkillers. Is that a bong? No, that's a candle. Damn. You can make it a bong. <laughs> yeah, you probably could. Ugh. I'm just gonna sit in this comfy-ass looking we chair, need, though. We don't have any decorative bowls or... or we really don't. Like, that. like... We kind of need some, I think. Yeah. Maybe that's an adult thing. I think it is. Also... I can eat my potato chips out of that. This, like, shelf thing here pisses me off because I'm like, how much shelf space have you lost because of your stupid little decorative front? Yeah, that would... Well... I could have another foot of books on each side. Plus, what's up with my witch's kettle down here? I was here? gonna say, the cauldron. Uh, that would be gone and I would have books <laughs> down there. I don't know. You know, we, we could have a cauldron. For We have one and it's full of candy. <laughs> True. Because we're adults. <laughs> we adult well. Okay, so, <laughs> first of all, yes, we have a candy bucket that's full of all times. It's actually a black pumpkin jack-o'-lantern thing with orange eyes. Second, how the fuck hungover are you when you need sunglasses to look at the lamp next to your bed? <laughs> what the shit did that you drink? That 40 watt, though. That kitchen, though. Fuck! I mean, seriously. <sighs> this is how much room we have on our countertop. Our toaster can't touch another appliance. <laughs> If it had arms, I don't know why that was a thing. I just decided to explain. But look damn at that it. teeny tiny table. Oh yeah. Well, is that a? I think by definition that's a breakfast nook. Yeah. It's a nook. And you, yeah. have, you can have breakfast there. Where's the breakfast cranny? <laughs> well, hold on. Let me go over here. I'll make some Thomas's English muffins. Let me go over here and I make some fucking. Co okay, that is a coffee maker. I wasn't sure it at first. Is. Make some they, I feel like they should have an espresso. Yeah, thing. they should have like the full deal. Let me go over here yeah, and assholes. blend some shit. And let me Gotta go over here. Gotta make my kale smoothie. Yep. And just to wash it down, I'm gonna make like the biggest bowl of fucking mashed potatoes this KitchenAid mixer can <laughs> handle. Mmm. Breakfast for days. And then I'm gonna go over here in my little nook, and I'm gonna look at the city of New York because I can't look out my window at the city of New York enough. So I took pictures of it so I could see New York. In my nook. I bet these are pictures that Alice took. Probably, yeah. That makes sense. Oh, hey, there's yeah, Alice. She's in the kitchen. Dad ass, though. <laughs> hey, bub. It's really not that great. Yeah, the one I was speaking for Alan, not me. Oh. Because <laughs> the way he was leaning in and looking at it. Why do you always wear the same outfit, Alice? Hey, what's up with that motorcycle jacket, too? I don't want to write anymore. I just want to type the letter J over and over and over all day like Sesame Street Honey, your hair me. is clipping through your back again. <laughs> you should We've get that talked look about at. that. <laughs> no, you're right, though. She also has a flat butt problem. Flat butts are just the thing in Alan Wake. So he has to finish the story. I'm sorry, sir, but I need to do this alone. Uh, what? Um, Dude. I don't think he's shooting her. That wasn't the intent, I don't think. I love you, man. I promise, if you don't make it, I'm gonna go curl up in your sock drawer and sleep for days. Good thing Alan Wake has a big sock drawer. Aww. Aww. How about <laughs> He was crying. He was. Hey, finally daylight. Oh, yeah, so in theory, the clicker... That was like his security blanket thing, right? But apparently he might be able to alter whether it's daylight or nighttime right now. Yeah, I got that. Okay. Yeah. So, I was just coming in on that. 
That's a hell of a useful power. <laughs> okay, no time to fuck out. Are you kidding me? Is that billboard really there? Yep. I have to do this. I, I, I am, like, completely honor-bound to do this. <clears throat> Don't waste the bullet. Can you hear me now? Actually, wait, looks like somebody may have shot it already. Do you see that? Are those bullet holes? No. Sprint was here. Yeah. It's a deer festival. <laughs> deer fest. Pretty much the only thing we Cuisine, have going for Cuisine, it was hot dogs. Oh, shit. I'm getting really sick of her. Okay. Is it dark again? Yep. Well, that okay. didn't last long. Nope. Hey, birdie. I was like, at this point, I was worried that there was going to be a freaking bear trap again. But I Burned. did. Burned. <laughs> Steal this car. I'm glad people just leave these cars on the side of the road for me. It helps. Boop, boop. <laughs> I'm waiting for the end of the game where I can't find any other cars, so I'm in that, like, classic red little Tykes really, car. Uh, you basically have your choice of cars yeah. here in Cauldron Lake. Let's well, see. there's the Majestic Motel. Hey, is it as advertised? That's the question. I think we're going to find out. Not very majestic. No, no, as majestic goes, this is, uh, pretty over-advertised. It's cute, but not majestic. <laughs> it's quaint. Yeah. Uh, those glasses, uh, are labeled Skanky Ho, I believe. <laughs> Do you see that? Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't think I want the thermos that's next to the toilet. <laughs> I, I, I think that's the coffee you just let go. So I think... Oh, I guess I can pretty much just raid everybody's shit. Oh, this was Agent Nightingale's. Well... Well, let's see. How good was, was his scotch? There was a party going on here. Oh... I think you're gonna jump it. Oh, I know I'm gonna jump it. Is it drivable? I hope hey, it is. Yes, that would be oh, the one I would take yes. over the jump, but. Oh, what the hell? Let's do it. Hey, Kenny! <laughs> I found your boat, man. Boat. <laughs> yeah, I think this was the car that you were specifically meant to take over the jump. Oh, shit. Nope, that was on purpose. Oh, your door fell off. <laughs> Grand oh, Theft your trunk fell off. <laughs> Ain't no junk in this trunk, which is there kind really of, isn't. There's nothing in there. That's kind of the theme for the game, isn't it? No junk in no trunks. <laughs> That'll buff out. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> They're throwing spools at me. Damn it! Let me drive for more than thirty seconds. What's the point of the car? This segment is just a little too broken up. I mean, it's like, oh, let's let you drive for a few seconds, and nope, you have to stop and yeah. fight through this tunnel of love. Our definition of love may be different than yours in Taken Land, but, you know, fight anyway. Eh, well, also reverse really sucks on these you things. You drove 300 feet, time to yep. get out of the car. And I would drive 300 <laughs> feet. But I won't let me drive anymore. <laughs> so yeah, that uh, that vaunted clicker really didn't do much, did it? Enjoy your thirty seconds of daylight, Alan. It's nighttime again. Oh yes. Wee! Yeah. <laughs> okay, how many hundreds of feet will I be able to drive this time? Wait. Four fifty. <laughs> I mean, I'm into the plot. Don't get me wrong. But some of it, like, you know, the childhood light switch and things like that, it's a little absurd. I get it. In fact, I think it's actually a really cool thing. There is the question still, good times any bring this up, is Alan Wake an actual person who always existed? Is he a creation of Thomas Zane's, the other writer? Or, I don't know. I don't know how that's going to go yet, and I feel like the game could throw... Plenty more curveballs at us between now and then. Coffee. I just don't know. I hope it's worth coffee, it. Coffee, 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 okay. coffee, 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 coffee things. <laughs> oh, nice. I forgot this is kind of like the game's version of a turret. Okay, let's let it cool it's down. Game's version of a turd. Dun 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 dun. Wait, God, this is much slower than that song implied. Yeah. 
pick up speed so I can hum the Indiana Jones theme. And bananas, apparently, is what I was trying to say instead. This is not nearly as exciting as I thought it would be. No, I kind of thought this was going to be, you know, at a breakneck pace and not like a leisurely cart ride through the birdies. So, I have enjoyed this game now that... Oh, kiss my ass! The fuck? You're right, though. It's like now at the end of the game, I'm finally figuring out what I'm doing. I would not go as far as saying I've gotten good, but oh, good. <laughs> we jumped up so you can put it right in my butt. <laughs> yeah, just shove that axe right here, guys. What now? Is, it, is that a house? Shit. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Come on, there we go. Yay. Whew. I kind of did something smart there, and I'm going to stand right here for a bit and drink my monster.